Hello everyone, this is Varun Dubey. I am going to explain you how to use the short code for body press plugin. I am activated that one and um, going to use these widgets on our pages. First of all, I am going to introduce uh, what we have in our new version uh, as elementary widget. Uh, we have introduced uh, three new widgets for the elementary first is to display activities, member listing and the group directories. And uh, you can display any certain number of activities on any page using these widgets and uh, you can also display uh, member grid and the group directory on the same page using these widgets like i have included uh, member directory going to also include the group directory here update so you have group directory member directory and the activities and uh, for the group directory you can display any specific count like suppose that I'm displaying six for the member directory I'm going to display six and for the activities I'm going to also going to display six number of activities okay and um, when you on the page you can also join group on the same section you can also join uh, add friend request on the same section you can also mark complete uh, mark favorite or add any comment from there on the same time and uh, like this so these are short course are going to give you a working model and uh, can be helpful on your landing pages where you can showcase use community features or like uh, any featured group or uh, any list of members there just to give them a quick overview of your community and uh, inside our pro version of the plugin uh, I'm going to deactivate the free version activating the pro version and uh, going to the page again it is the elementum pro version gives you a little bit more flexibility like uh, you have option like uh, filter these mem uh, groups uh, based on their member type or you can exclude or include based on these group type or you can also exclude or in include any groups uh, based on their group ids and you can also display them based on the uh, like uh, ascending and the descending order based on alphabet popular like this one and you can also have a control like uh, like suppose that you have to only display uh, the group listing based on uh, to those groups which I have joined like uh, display logged in user group like this one and uh, same for the member directory uh, you can also have to you can display members based on uh, their member type uh, filter member based on the member type you can also include or include based on the member type filter based on their member role like uh, suppose that I have to exclude myself from there because I am an admin so I can also exclude myself from this directory easily just by selecting a drop down option and um, for the activities uh, we also have uh, options like uh, which activity we have to display based on IDs based on their object type like suppose that this is a group activity so I'm going to select a group type so it will only display those activities which belong to the group component same like this one for the front component for the blog component like any activity which is related to the site-wide activity including the blog component like this one so it will give you a flexibility uh, like what exactly you are planning to display there and um, give you more better control on those things you can also allow posting from the front end suppose that I'm going there again after updating the page like this I can also post from there I can also include some comment like this hopefully you will like these features if you have any feedback or comment let us know we will hopefully try to include those one in our coming updates thank you